Nassar Electronics presents Protection Against Voltage Surges. What is a voltage surge? A surge is a voltage spike of very short duration in the power lines. This leads to an unexpected increase of thousands of volts and amps that can damage equipment despite its short duration. Electric surges can cause damage or even destroy all the equipment connected to the power line. This may imply equipment losses, production downtime, costly repairs, interruptions and disruptions of vital services. Examples of vulnerable equipment. Electric motors are susceptible to damage by power surges since high voltage damages the insulation of the magnet wire in the winding. This shortens the life of the motor and can even burn it out during the power surge. Electronic equipment are generally the most vulnerable devices, as the electronic components inside are very sensitive to electric shocks. Electrical equipment, such as circuit breakers, contactors, relays, transformers, and other components are also frequently damaged by surges. Origin of surges. Voltage surges have mainly two origins. One, sudden changes of large inductive or capacitive loads, such as connections, disconnections, interruptions, or short circuits. Two, lightning or atmospheric discharges. These can be classified in two types, direct and indirect. Classification of surge intensity. Type A. They are lower than 20,000 amps and are normally originated by load connections or disconnections. Type B. They are lower than 40,000 amps and are caused by indirect lightning strikes. Type C. They are lower than 60,000 amps. These surges are caused by lightning directly striking the power lines. Surge protection. Lightning arresters are used to protect high voltage power lines. In low voltage AC power circuits, the most effective protection are surge suppressors. Lightning arresters are the best form of protection against direct line discharges. They work by diverting the discharge to ground. Although they do not completely suppress the surge peak, they do absorb much of its destructive capacity when properly installed. If the lightning arrestor is not effectively grounded, it will not divert the discharge to ground successfully. For this reason, it is important to check the ground resistance with special measuring equipment. This resistance should be between 3 and 10 ohms. The value varies depending on the country and the capacity of the substation transformer. If a surge in the high voltage line is too strong, or if the grounding system is not effective, the discharge will carry on to the low voltage line. To suppress this, a protection on the low voltage line is necessary. PD Series Surge Protectors Nassar Electronics has designed the PD voltage suppressor to protect against voltage surges in low voltage AC power circuits. PD series surge arresters shield equipment and motors against surges of up to 40,000 amps. Voltage suppressors work by absorbing surges. When a voltage spike occurs in the line, the suppressor absorbs it, preventing the voltage from reaching a dangerous level. PD series surge protectors have a status indicator for each line to show the suppressor is operational and protecting the line. The indicator will turn off if the surge protector is damaged by a discharge greater than the protector's shielding capacity. This implies that the line is unprotected and the suppressor must be replaced. Model Description Two models are available. The PD300 for single phase systems in 120 and 220 volt with a protection capacity of 20,000 amps. The PD640 for three phase systems in 220 and 440 volt 
with a protection capacity of up to 40,000 amps. Nassar Electronics is a pioneer in the design and manufacture of electrical and electronic equipment since 1973 and has presence in more than 25 countries around the world. For more information, visit www.nassarelectronics.com.